All right, welcome, 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 everybody. My name is Ebag, and today we're going to go ahead and do another playthrough with In Zone, A World Apart. We're going to go ahead and continue where we left off in episode five and continue trying to build our little settlement here. Settlement. <laughs> um, trying to get this up in, um, you know, growing. We got some, you know, little warnings down here that we have to keep an eye on. We are definitely running out of water and food. So right now I'm trying to figure out what would be the best um, for that at this current state. I'm thinking maybe shuffling around some of my workers, um, taking a couple off of hunting, put them in fishing and farming. That might help because it's a little closer, so we can work on that. But we do have a drought coming our way, so um, we'll go ahead and harvest this now. That way we can get that. And really, that's all we can really do at this point. And then hopefully we can get enough food in to take care of everyone. We don't have much water, so that's going to be a little bit of a bind at this state. So we're going to try to get through this so we can um, definitely... Uh, let's put another hunter. Yeah, let's do that. Um, hopefully we can get through this. this so let's go ahead and get going. Let's push that play button. Also, we have some challenges here that we're going to try to meet. But I don't know if we can. Like this one. Uh, we need to build a water tower. So we can go ahead and start getting that going. Because I think we have enough for that. Um, and then we can get that going and built up. And then hopefully we can get some points from that. We'll get some water from that so that would help and this we're just waiting for our decontamination post to be done and once that's done then we can start making those kits and hopefully you can get that we get some food from that so that might help i'm really would like to be able to do this one um that would be really nice we're at a five out of five just gotta get the food and water but that's gonna be tough if we can get these rewards done that might help out but, yeah, I don't know. Because I don't want to take that penalty. It would be nice, but I, I don't know. We're running out of time on that one. It's getting kind of short, so we're into the drought. So let's go ahead and take those off. Now, they're supposed to be picking this, which they are. So we'll leave them. We'll get the hunters going. Um, the herbalists we don't need. Technically, we don't need those these waterers as well. Go ahead and get some builders going. Um, we'll do two here for now. And then we'll put one there and one there. And hopefully we can get through this without not much of a bind. Let's see what happens. You know, they're getting that food. They should be at least. Or is it just going down? No, they're picking it. Yeah, they're picking it. Okay. At least we'll get something. That way the drought, that they don't get lost in the drought. Let's go ahead and build this next. Let's, you know, we need both of these, but really we just need to get this up and running. I need these 12 plastic. Ooh, that's going to take into our plastic. Ugh. It's all right. We'll keep collecting. It's going to take 12. Um, eight in reserve. So I put it down. I don't know if that's if it already took it out. And that's what I have left is 22. I'm not sure what that means. All right, speed it up just a little bit so they can get working. See what happens. All right, we got another thing here. All right, they're just going to make mask. Yeah, let's see if we can get that built up. Oh, they got to remove the radiation. That's why. All right, the farm is done. So let's remove them. Let's put two on charcoal boner so we can get some more charcoal. Yeah, we need more coal. Well, that just 
done. Need more coal. Okay, okay. Water buildings in this category. Seven out of, or six out of eight. And science, okay, water carrier. Oh, nice. Well, if we can get that up, that would be nice, but I don't know if that would be possible. You're running out of water bad. Uh-oh, that's not good. We got six coal coming our way. That's all we really need. What's going on here? It needs water or coal. Oh, wow. Okay, we got some mass. That's good. Alright, it needs more plastic. I got plastic coming my way. Hopefully we can get through this. I don't know, because this has been up and down. This is definitely a struggle. Definitely a struggle. All right, so they got what? We got what, what? All right, we'll switch this over to cloth, and then, because we'll be good on plastic. Just need two, and I got the two coming. All right, whoop, let's slow it down a little bit. Let's get our water collectors going. Right, we lost, we're down a little bit. Uh, let's see, let's pull one from there. Put one there. Take that off. Put there. Put two. Oh, oh, we're losing people now. Dang, and there's Okay, I feel like I lost a little bit more people than usual. Is this water? Activate it. All right, there we go. Boom, that's going to help. All right, now we need rain collector. If we can get this up, that'll be good. It's going down. It's going down. No, just don't go down. It's the water situation. Oh man, it's gonna take a while for my kids to grow up too. It's definitely lacking on the water front and the food front now. I just got a bunch of water. You're telling me none of them got water from that? I just got 400 water. I should have took care of everyone. Or is that something else? Am I missing something? I thought we just got a bunch of water and now all of a sudden it's gone? And it didn't take care of anybody? Still 25 people that are thirsty? Food, okay. Let's 
build a farm or orchard. Yeah, I'm kind of confused on that. We just got a bunch of water and yet it did nothing. Still a bunch of people thirsty. Hmm. We only have 30 people here and we had 400 things of water. How do, how do we lose that already? Pretty sure that was water, right? I don't know. Confused. Quite confused on how the resources work in this game. They seem to come very slow but go away very fast. Like, I just did that, that quest and it didn't seem to do anything other than nothing. Because I had 25 people that were still thirsty and it did nothing. And it's all gone. Interesting! Twenty-seven people. Now we get the rain collector. We should be good, though. Once we get the rain collector up and working, we should be all right. Getting some people sick, though. We just need that water. I definitely take their time doing anything. And I feel like if you speed it up, it just puts everything in overdrive and it just goes insane. I feel like, the, like especially with the resource management, it seems to go down at a fast rate, even at a normal speed. I just, uh, I'm not sure. If I speed it up to get things done, it tends to throw things in chaos. Hmm. Yeah, we're... Okay, we're starting to build up some water, I guess. Let's go ahead and speed it up, see what happens. See if that goes down. We need some people. Uh, it's not good. Oh, ugh, lots of kid. Those are crucial. I need those more than anything. Why do they go first? Yeah, I know. It's a shame, huh? I haven't yet to produce one of these? Whoa, how long does it take? It doesn't tell me. Where's it at? Um, half. Almost a half a season. That thing's been up and running for a while. And you haven't built one yet? Hmm. Hmm. And here it goes. We're going down downhill now. Man. Man, oh man. See, I kicked it in overdrive just to get things done. It's like you can't. It's almost like you really can't. You just gotta sit here and wait. It's like they punish you for going fast. There's nothing for me to do. But yet I lose more people. But yet the resources are not coming in. <laughs> I might have to turn the difficulty down. I wonder if there's a way of just turning it down a little bit. Because this is insane. It's like, it's tough. I'm like, now nah, I lost another kid. And more kids. Yeah. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, ay. Alright, now the water situation is good, but we just lost a lot of people, almost 10 people. Lost all our fishers, yep. Yeah, we got that. Cool, what was that from? Man, we should have been able to do that. Why did that take so long? We should have been able to get that one. And we'll get this one. We'll get this one right here. 
Yeah, better luck next time. Not my fault. He took forever. What's this? Missing resources to repair this building. What do you mean? Oh my gosh, they went out and threw all that food already? So it's like the resources go way too fast in this. Like, it's, it goes really fast. Did we get this now? We do. All right, so we got a rain collector. That's good. That is good. Um, What resources do you need to repair this? I mean, we're kind of low on everything. Oh, great. We lost a worker here, huh? Oops. Okay. All right. Okay. What are we going to do? We need some food. We need some food. We lost all our fishers. I, don't know, I think we need to pull them back on fishing. That might be the better route. What's going on here? Oh. What is that? A pecan? Choose a seed. Oh, our tasks are all gone now. <laughs> cool, 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 cool. Getting there, getting there. We'll be. I think we'll be able to bounce back from this. Doesn't look too bad. Doesn't look too bad. Now if we can just get some people on food. We should be good. Now our water. Should be taken care of. Our water shouldn't be much of an issue right now. Should be good on that, because now we got a rain collector. That's not going to rain for a very long time, but once it does, we'll be all right. Uh, we just need to wait for some of our kids to grow up so we can put them to get the food. There's 16 food out of that. I think the farms are kind of where they are at. I think the downside of them is because it has to rain, and we're not getting any rain for a while, so they're going to kind of take a while to grow, but I think the good side is that it's easier to get because it's just right there. It's where everywhere else is so far away. Mm -hmm. I guess we can build the road. Get a road going. Our scrap metal is over here. Let's go change this to over here. Should be good. All right, I think we might be able to bounce back from this. A little bit of loss. We got a little bit of setback. We should be okay. Should be okay. We got a couple people that are hungry. Man, it's not gonna rain for a while. Oh boy. I wish this would tell you what you needed to fix this thing. Why is it telling me? It just says missing resources. What do you need? Ah. Oh, metal. I'm gonna get you some metal. You need three? That's an odd number. But three, we will get you. Oh, wait. I don't have anybody on the herb herbs, do I? Uh-oh. Oh, no. I don't really have anyone to pull off, though. Let's see. 
everyone's kind of needed. People are getting a little sick. Coal is being used for what? <laughs> Definitely for mask. <laughs> Go ahead and speed it up a little bit. And yeah, we're getting a little sick out here. No rain. I have to go through two more seasons without rain. Wow. Okay. <laughs> uh huh. I need a herbalist. Yeah, you gotta go out there. Sorry, but yeah, you gotta go out there. We need to get you uh, get some herbs. We're getting people sick right now. As much as I need people gathering food as well. Numbers starting to increase a little bit. Ah. Ah, we lost a refiner. All right, we need one more. Oh, this one again? Oh, come on. Oh, that's a bummer. The numbers are a little lower, though. I might be able to do that one, actually. That one's a little easier. Well, people are dropping left and right. Yay! 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 Hmm. Oh, that's nice. That one's already done. It's gonna re give that to me. I like that. Okay, we got three metal now, so let's do cloth. when I see the numbers of kids go down. Ugh, don't like that. <laughs> it's the more important number. Great. Uh-oh. Food's a problem. Food is a problem in this game. It is the hardest thing to get. They eat so much, and uh, what do you want me to do right now? Let's take a farmer away and get a fisher. I have nothing. Nothing.
Yeah, no one's manning that farm. Uh oh. Really not worried about it. Yeah, we got some water. That's good. I'm not really worried about that because once it rains, we're fine. Needs coal. Yeah, everything needs everything. I got it. I thought we'll be able to recover from this. We're not even be able to do this part. Come on, we're almost there. Oh, man. Nope. <laughs> nope. Okay, we got the food stored. That's just for happiness. And we just need water. And just needs the rain. Just needs the rain. Well, at least we have plenty of homes. That's a good thing. Alright, it's about to be a rainy season soon. Then we get a bunch of water, and then we'll be good. Just hopefully they don't go... See what? They got stored and reserved. I mean, it's weird. Hopefully they don't start digging into that. Yeah, fishing is definitely where it's at. That kind of bumped up with fishing. Yeah, I think fishing's... Oh, come on. Just rain already so I can collect this reward. What else do I need? I already got the other thing. I think fishing is a lot better, actually. Because I kind of bumped up. I brought that number down when I put a fisherman on there. That's good to know. That seemed to do the trick. That was a little quicker. Yay, we got that. So I boost up that. That's good. <laughs> but we're losing adults left and right, so yeah. Just take our teacher away. We need our herbs. Actually, we could just do this. Put one on everything. There. That's all we can really do. All we can really do right now. But yay, the water's coming in! <laughs> the water! Okay, so as long as we keep everybody somewhat happy, we get someone doing a job and everything, we should be okay. I don't know. We did lose a lot of people. We started with 31 and like 10 kids, and now we're down to 18 and 4. But, you know, we do have everybody working something, so we should be able to climb back. We have the water now. That should help with our water gain. It's contaminated because we have no coal. Hopefully we can stop losing people left and right. And start building up our population again. So I guess once we're down low, right, we'll just start back over. Uh, as long as we keep everybody happy and, you know, the jobs are filled. We'll be able to maintain what we have. Eventually, they'll, you know, they'll drop out and we'll have enough to gather the resources needed so I think you start with like 10 settlers in the get go so should be able to do that we have everything now now we just gotta get it filled up so I think I'm gonna start working on getting everybody in the fishers so we can build up our food now we got a drought coming uh oh That's, not, that's okay though. If we get this, we got a rainy season coming in. So we'll be able to collect um, Is that going away? Probably. Oh no, it's going up. Um the rain we got a rainy season coming in, so we'll be able to collect some food or water and then 
So that's good. That should get us through the drought. Okay. We just need to worry on our, work on our food now. And that's just a matter of getting people to do the job. So I think we'll be alright. I think we'll be able to bounce back from this. I think so, at least. And now we have, we have a school. Teaching and productivity. Should be pretty good. <laughs> Starting to get the hang of it. Definitely a huge learning curve on this game. It is definitely a challenging game. For sure. As long as we keep everything going. See, that's cloth and that's cloth. As long as we get a bunch of cloth coming in. Should be alright. For our protective gear, that is. <laughs> cool. All right. I think we're making progress here. We got some things that we have to keep us uh, surviving for the future. Now our big thing that we really need to focus on is getting our food resources up. And I have all the stuff to get the food. We just need, now need to get some people coming in. Um, and hopefully, you know, I do got two coming, about three coming my way that are kids that are turning into adults so I can use those shortly. But I am also kind of dipping down. I lost two more adults, so hopefully I can get these three up and get them going. And then I'll be able to put those pretty much all in food right now. And then we'll focus on that. And hopefully we can get our food resources built up. And that's the main goal is getting our food and water resources taken care of. Because those are the real two chat like the most two important things you can have and it's really a struggle to keep them as well as everything else kind of tends to work like on its own like i haven't really struggled getting the other stuff it seemed to be pretty easy to get all that just the food and water they eat that stuff up real quick so you got to be on top of that so we'll do that in the next episode we'll go ahead and focus on that try to get as many um food gatherers as possible and hopefully we can bounce back we started this episode with 30 people and now we're down to 16 um adults that is so let's see what happens in the next episode hopefully we go up and not down if we keep going down that's not good but hey anyways that's that and for now i will talk to you all later